But ask the animals, and they will teach you, or the birds in the sky, and they will tell you, or speak to the earth, and it will teach you, or let the fish in the sea inform you. Which of all these does not know that the hand of the Lord has done this? In his hand is the life of every creature and the breath of all mankind. Job 12, 7-10 through 10. Have you ever asked yourself what purpose your life had? Or if you have anything beneficial to offer this world? Or maybe even how you could possibly be considered valuable to someone, let alone to God? As humans, we most often diminish our worth and value during the challenging or difficult times throughout our lives. Just as in Job's life, he too experienced challenges that made him question his life worth, value, and purpose. He lost his livestock, his workers, his children, his home, and his health. Everything. His friends made things even worse by condemning him, saying that he clearly deserved all of this for something he must have done. Job's response was not to turn against God or have self-pity on himself, but instead he urged his friends to look with him to the beautiful creation of God that is overflowing with purpose, value, worth, and the intricate hand of the Father. The animals, no matter their size, shape, or color, are all unique and perfectly designed. The way they eat their food, build their homes, raise their families, or defend themselves against predators are all different, yet center around the careful and intentional design of the great creator. The birds of the sky circle around, communicating to one another in their own unique languages, singing songs of praise and adoration to their creator, God Almighty. They search the ground for the supply of food that God has given them. The earth displays glory to God through its abundance of beautiful colors. Every plant has a specific purpose and function that shows just how detailed and artistic its creator truly is. The trees rooted to the earth spring up towards the skies glorifying the Lord God who sits enthroned in heaven. The running waters throughout the area provide necessary nutrients and hydration that this delicate environment desperately needs to survive. If the Lord provides purpose for every drop, how much more will he provide purpose for your life as well? The challenges we face the situations we walk through and the difficult times that are bound to come will force us to choose one of two options. We can either look at our circumstances as a reason to have self-pity and turn our backs toward God, or we can choose to immerse ourselves in the abundant creation of God found in nature that is thriving with purpose, value, and worth reminding ourselves that we are considered to be of much more value to the Lord, showing that our lives have truly significant meaning.